Hello, Lonely Squad. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, this is like a different type of video that I choose to on my channel, but I had this video idea for a while and I felt like doing it for today's video. But today we'll be ranking Roblox driving games. Just to let you know, these are my opinion. No hate to the other games I'll be ranking today, but. Yeah, today we're going to be ranking, I don't know how much games, but we're ranking a few, like, good games I've actually played. I'm not 100% sure, like, if i played all these games before, but I tried to pick at least 10 games to rank. But we'll be playing all those games also in this video. We'll also be ranking all of them for today's video. It's going to be a tier list, so if you guys would like to do this for yourself, make sure you go to the description and go ahead and look for the link and you guys can make your own roblox tier list like driving games but yeah remember this is just driving games it's not like roblox games driving games but yeah anyways here's today's video shout out and if one of these people going to subscribe become an official nz squad member make sure to buy some of that fire in the description as always but yeah now it is time to go review the tier list all right, we're finally on the custom tier list I made just for this series, but yeah, it'll be driving Roblox games tier list maker, but yeah, the link will be in the description. We'll be ranking games such as Southwest Florida, Emergency Response, Welcome to Robloxian, Driving Simulator, Vehicle Legends, Rensselaer County, R Richmond, Virginia, Pacifico, Roanoke, Ultimate Driving, Hillview County Roleplay, Overdrive, Pembroke Pines, Florida, Greenville, Driving Empire, and Vehicle Simulator. Games like that we will be reviewing for today's video. I'm extremely sorry if I did not pick a game that you guys really wanted for this video. But yeah, we're going to go get on with our first game. Alright, we are in our first game, which is Southwest Florida. You guys probably remember this game. Honestly, this game I really haven't played in a while, nor have I really wanted to play it. I mean, honestly, it's honestly a really cool game. Like, this is probably the most popular Roblox game as, like, not Roblox game, but Roblox driving game um, on Roblox so far. But usually whenever I play, I usually just play for, like, the codes and things like that. I'm thinking about doing more videos on this game, but I'm just not 100% sure if anybody wants me to do the video, like, some of these videos on Southwest or not. Because, you know, my, my channel's all really about Greenville, but... Yeah, today we're doing like a different type of video to check like the tier list of popular Roblox games. Greenville Roblox games, of course. Not green. <laughs> driving games on Roblox. But, yeah. Anyways, now it's time to honestly do a review of Southwest Florida and how I'm going to rank it. So basically, we have four, five rankings. We have the S tier, A tier, B tier, C tier, and D tier. So, yeah. Honestly, the game is really nice. I really like it, and I also love these BMWs. Honestly, these BMWs are really cool. And something I really like about, like, Southwest Florida, they actually have a lot of uh, variances of cars, such as Ford, BMW. I don't know, like, they have, like, a lot of cars. So we're going to go stop ahead at the dealership, because I want to discover, like, what type of vehicles they do have. But, like, yeah, Southwest Florida is really a cool role-playing game. Like, I haven't really played in a while, and I definitely want to play it some soon. Like, honestly, my connection really on this game isn't that bad. I don't understand, but, like, it's honestly, like, better than Greenville. But, yeah. Let's go into the dealership. Okay, let's just turn in here. Okay. Let's time to go out. Let's go ahead and review some of these cars so we can see what type of cars they got. I mean, they are... We already see some stuff in the parking lot, which is Range Rover. So, they have stuff like Chevy. They have, um... Let's see here. BMW, Lexus, Toyota, hmm, Rolls Royce, Honda, Audi, Lamborghini, McLaren, things like that. They have like a lot of variants of, ve of the vehicles. And honestly, they also have a lot of jobs in game. So let's go ahead and click the jobs. They have like an apartment job. They have ca cafe job. They have criminal, dealership employee, fin fintech employee, McBloxers employee, Meritage employee. Police, bank employee, drift driver, which aka is like an Uber driver. We have a stud rack, unemployed, CV, CVS, uh, seaside bar and grill, Publix, Publix, um, hospital worker, firefighter, sheriff, paramedic, 
Dippin' Donuts, aka Dunkin' Donuts, an automatic employee. You also have Twitter codes, so if you go to your settings here, you guys can see that there is Twitter codes. And over here we have location markers, vehicle auto flip, vehicle collisions, and passenger seats unlocked. Twitter codes, tree shadows, and also the version number and the game version. Here's all the cars I have. I don't have a lot of cars in game, but yeah, I don't have any emergency vehicles. Like here I have a few vehicles. We have like, I have like a Dodge vehicle. I have a BMW, Ford. This is like whenever I used to do Southwest Florida videos also. I have a few supercars. We have vans, motorcycles. I think I got one of the motorcycles, yeah. Then this is also another cool feature. They actually have motorcycles. Which, a lot of games do not have motorcycles. And there's a, there's a few that actually have motorcycle game, like motorcycles in their games. But, like, Southwest Florida is, like, honestly, a really cool game to have, like, so motorcycles. And, like, I really like the detail they put into the motorcycles. Such as, like, whenever you're looking down. Or, like, at the Oh, my. Okay. But, like, the detail on the motorcycle is really cool. And I just flapped myself onto the ground. But, yeah, honestly, the Southwest Florida motorcycles are really cool. And, honestly... I really like this game. I haven't played it in a while, and I really want to play it for videos because, like, it's a driving game. And there's like a lot of cool things we can review, like for um, videos. So let me know if you guys would like to see some Southwest Florida videos, and who would actually watch them? Because I really want to do some Southwest Florida videos. Okay, how do I like look up? Because I remember you guys could look up. No. I don't know, like, how you're supposed to look up. Okay, I want to kind of, like, do a... Uh, what is it, like, a... I don't know what to, how to call it, but, yeah. Anyways, now it's time to go back to the tier list and rank the game. Alright, we're back on the tier list. And now it's time to go ahead and review the tier list for Southwest Florida. So, the ranking I'm going to give for Southwest Florida, it has to be at least an A tier. I mean, I would give it an S tier, but, honestly, I just don't feel like it's a role-playing game it, it seems like it like ne like a next like popular like roblox game but i don't know like i mean honestly southwest florida is a really fun game i would give it like a medium tier like s and a but honestly i can only give it one tier so honestly it's a or s honestly really cool game i really love it but yeah all games i will be reviewing in this video will be linked in the description but yeah anyways now let's go on with our next game elrc emergency response all right, we are in our next game, which is ELRC. But the cool thing about like so, um, ELRC, they do have a phone. You can call emergency responses and also players in game. But yeah, let's go ahead and review some of their cars. They don't have. I mean, they actually have a nice amount of vehicles. It's honestly not really detailed vehicles. If you guys don't understand what I'm saying, because this is why I don't really play play ELRC because I don't like the detail of the vehicles, and they also have copyright logos. So yeah, here's like the Ford. Ex Shush. Uh, Ford Explorer, honestly, really undetailed. I don't know why. I just don't like the vehicles in Southwest. And why is there so not the Southwest LRC? But yeah, let's go ahead and spawn what car I, ha I do have, which is the truck. Okay, let's go ahead and review some of the menus options. So here we have. Oh, they actually updated this. Okay, we have civilian, sheriff, firefighter, police, and also DOT. Which honestly, a lot of these departments are really cool. But the play the game has also died after the Metaverse event. Yeah, you can also play this game on mobile, which is crazy. You have also cash, you can buy some cash here. You have servers, which you can just join roleplay servers, things like that. And a tutorial. Nice. And honestly, this game is based off of LSPDFR, which you can get for like GTA 5, which is also Grand Theft Auto. Honestly, I think that's why they got their like idea. Like, um. I think that's how they got their idea about this game, LRC, emergency responses. Because I honestly think they were trying to do like a vibe just like LSBDFR, but they're doing like LRC, emergency responses. Which honestly, I really don't like this game. I don't really play it as much. I just don't like how undetailed the map is. I understand you use a lot of Terry Ann, but like some of the buildings on LRC is just like very unrealistic and like probably needs an update. Such as like the Liberty County gun and ammo. ammo. But the, the back, like the interiors of the houses. So let's go over to a house. Which I'll, there's like a few houses in game. Some of the houses are pretty cool. So yeah, let me see. Let's see what type of house I really don't like. Uh, let's go here. 
Uh, go down here. I'm not 100% sure where, where the house is going to like. I mean, some of them are actually really nicely detailed. But, yeah. Let's just go to this house. I just don't really like the interior of the house. Unless they updated it. Okay, buy home. And like this. Like, this doesn't make no sense. Because, it's weird. I mean, honestly, can you? Wait, hold up. I'm going to go to this house. Uh, let me go to this house next door. I'm going to see, like, what's, like, the very, like, what you guys do. Yeah. It's kind of, like, oh. Can I select it? Purchase. Large. One hour. Wait, what? You have to pay for this house? For an hour? Yo, that is not good. And plus, you know, I don't have enough money. Can I purchase it? Bruh. So basically, you can't purchase this house. You have to get the standard house, which is honestly not really good because that means you have to buy more passes, and you don't even get the house that you actually are in front of. So we have to purchase this house from like for three thousand dollars. All right, in these series, but let's go inside. I'm just sorry, but the house, the house management is really not good. It just for this, this is honestly so bad. And why is there someone calling me? Hi, call. Oh, guess I have no friends. <laughs> Anyways, um, I don't really like the house details of the house. I mean, bro, he's calling back. Okay, answer. What do you want? What do you want, sir? Why answer? Why call if you're not even gonna answer? But yeah, the details of the houses are like the interiors are not really that good and not not worth it for your money. Oh, it's a fan. Hi, I'm Rec. Say hi. But, honestly, the detail of the house is not really as good as I really thought, honestly. The, I don't really like the detail, but, yeah, thank you to this person for being a fan. But, yeah. But, like, honestly, the detail of the house is really not that good. That's not the only issue I only have with this game. It's the detail is not really worth the time of, um, like, your money. The money for the house. So I wonder if I can go ahead and sell it. One hour plus remaining. I can't sell the house to get my money back. Lovely. I'm recording. Recording. But yeah, let's go ahead and review some more of this game. Like, the only thing I really play this game is for, like, the emergency responses. Because honestly, like, patrolling a lot. It's really fun. And the little thing they actually have is the um, map. You can actually check the whole map. But, yeah. That's really all about like what I really wanted to review, but let's go ahead and review the the tier list and see what we're gonna rank it as. All right, we are back on the tier list. So the game we just reviewed was Emergency Responses Liberty County, which the game I'm gonna review it for. I'm gonna give it a uh, I don't know. I'm gonna give it a B or C. Uh, for my ranking, I'm extremely sorry, but I'm gonna give it a C. Honestly, the game is alright. I mean, like it's not my favorite game, so I'm not really gonna make it a huge rank so yeah anyways now it's gonna go ahead and get on with the next game all right we are in our next game which is welcome to roblox i mean actually it's actually called neighborhood the uh, neighborhood of robloxian actually i thought it was like welcome to like no or something but i guess i was wrong but here's the game we were playing i mean i played this like a few days ago and this game was honestly low-key fun honestly but yeah anyways we also have house icons we have emotions you can cry because you know i'll be crying a lot but yeah we have also avatar loading which you can honestly go ahead and like edit your avatar you can be a dog i, I mean if you want uh here i, I want to be an animal there we go uh there look at me i'm hot oh no anyways um we also have a few cars. I mean, honestly, I don't have any money for like this car type of cars. We also have weather, which is pretty cool. Uh, go off that. Go off that, and let's go ahead and. We also have cash, and we also have settings. So you can block users, which is pretty cool. You can mute the music, so that's pretty cool. But look how I walk. It's just crazy. But let's go ahead and spawn my car. Um, where do I spawn cars? I already have that car. Okay, thank you. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and spawn this. The crazy thing is, while you're an animal, you can also go ahead and still drive your car. It just looks so stupid because you're driving while you're an animal. Honestly, the only thing I like playing this game is to for the crashing. I'm playing with friends. 
I haven't played this game for a while, and nor do I think anybody has really played this game for a while. I mean, honestly, a lot of people probably forgot this game, and this is why I'm putting in today's video, because this is honestly an OG game that a lot of people just probably do not remember, or, like, no, no longer play. It's honestly, like, a really fun game, but, yeah, it has houses, it has, like, things like this, we have icons, we have turn signals, and things like that, and we also have the map. The map it does include a police department, Burgerway, aka uh, Burger King, um, uh, school and things like that, a hospital, fire department, and things like that. Honestly, I mean the game really does include a lot of things you can honestly like for role playing. The game honestly is kind of unrealistic. I mean, honestly, it's a really nice role playing game. You still have nice variances of cars. So let's go back over here, purchase cars, things like that. And you also have trucks, muscle, job, cargo, SUV, and also motorcycle. Both overall, the game's really fun. Make sure to go ahead and play this game. I want to do some like uh, live streams with this game. Just let me know if you guys would honestly like to see some like, gameplay in this or something. But yeah, honestly, that's really all for this game. Let's go ahead back over to the tier list. All right, we are in our next game. No, we're not in our next game. But we're back on the tier list. Now it's time to do a ranking for well, um, Neighborhood of Robloxian. So basically, I really like the game. I'm going to go ahead and give it a B. I would have given it like, a C, but like, honestly, it's an OG game. Like, why would I put it like under a rank? But honestly, B is really cool of a ranking. And honestly, a really good spot for the Neighborhood of Robloxian. But yeah, let's go ahead and get on to our next game. Alright, we are back in another game, which is Driving Simulator. But anyways, this is Driving Simulator. I put this game, I think, once for a video. If you guys remember that video, you guys are OG. But let's go ahead and review some of these cars. They have, like, the spawn option. You have, like, an Audi here. It's like the vehicle. I mean, you also can get more cars. The only thing I really like about this, like, dealership thing is, like, like oh my gosh. Like, whenever you look at the vehicles, it's so cool. Is that BMW? Yo. Uh, I think this is going to be right here, but I can't buy it right now because I don't play this game a lot. Nor do I have, like, a lot of money. Uh, let's go into cars, exit, and let's go ahead and spawn my Audi. Honestly, this is not really, like, a role-playing game. It's more like a racing game. Which, honestly, this game is really cool. I just don't play it because it's not my type of game I would play. Usually, whenever I'm playing a Roblox game or driving game it would be if it's like a role-playing game honestly so honestly this is not a type of game i would play but if you're looking for a nice racing game this is the game to go because honestly this map is pretty cool i mean i really don't like the detail of the trees but it's not my type like my type but it's all right and the detail of the game like is really cool i mean honestly i really did not review everything in game this is like downtown area but honestly i don't feel like this is a racing like no, a driving game i feel it's like a racing game which is also the same, because it do your driving still, so, yeah, it's honestly the same. And this have a bridge here, I'm gonna go and do a jump, We yo, <gasps> yo, I made that, let's go. I hate this game, same, just, ki just kidding, I don't hate this game at all, honestly, it's a fun game, dang it. But they also do have a map, you can like, yeah, it's a racing game, because you guys can see, um, racing things, things like that. And I'm right here, guys. But let's continue this way. I think there's like a freeway or something up here. If not a freeway, then some. Let's go over here. Hope dies. But yeah, that's honestly really all I can review for this game. Honestly, there's nothing fun about the game. So yeah. Anyways, not say go on with the tier list again. All right, we are on with the next game, like the tier list. So the game we were just playing was Driving Simulator. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a rating of a C tier. It's not my type of game I would play it daily. So that's why I'm giving it a C. So yeah. Anyways, now it's time to get on with the next game, which is Vehicle Legends. All right, that is going to wrap up today's video. The video is way too long. We already hit 20 minutes of a video. So we're going to do a part two. Make sure to continue for part two that's coming out the next day after this one. You guys get to continue watching this series. There will be in total of three parts because this is an hour video.
But yeah, anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video today. If you did, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Just to let you know, part two will be releasing the day after this video is released. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next part. See you guys!